beim Wiesen. Well, hello and welcome back, and thanks for coming back downtown. Gator Pathos is waiting, especially for you. And there's a lot of blueness. There's people having the time of their lives. Feast your eyes and digest. There's people walking on rocks. There's people jet skiing. There's people parasailing. And there's people snorkeling in the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. Now, without further ado, I'm going to introduce you to the most beautiful woman in the world. She's dancing, she's prancing, and of course her name is Miss Ochin. Gracia Labo. Hello everybody. How nice to see you again and again. Amazing day. I think this year the season started much, much earlier than the previous year. I think so. There's no doubt about it. Summer has come early to downtown Kedapakos. We are in the municipality swimming area and there are people transcending in their shorts and their bikinis out into the blueness of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. All that's missing, guess what, is you. So come on, come and join us. You know you want to, like Lady, oh, oh so, so sweet Caroline and Lord Nigel, the big guns, they've let the little secret out of the bag that they're coming back to downtown Kerib Pathos and there are thousands, no, hundreds of thousands of people who are going to get on a big bird or a canoe and paddle like crazy because they understand that Pathos is quite simply the greatest holiday destination in the world. Of course, and every time you arrive here we think that it's for the first time, this is the feeling we've got. Of course we know that we know you well, of course we know that we met you before, of course, but every time this sense of worrying in the heart, uh, at least in mind, that we're gonna see this, uh, this uh, waiting process, you know, worrying process, if everything okay when they arrive and how do they accost us, and normally they do it well. Yes, they do indeed. And of course, if there's anything we can do to help you, if you find yourself in any kind of trouble in Paphos, you message us and we'll do our very, very best to sort out that little problem. Now, we invite you to come with us for a little walk along the downtown Kera Paphos promenade. And of course, a lot of people are curious to know because the headlines around the world are, you know, Paphos, roadworks everywhere, not on the promenade, not in the harbour area. No, the most important parts to you are all finished and they are all waiting especially for you and look even this ball is full to the brim and it's been gardened and it's waiting to blossom especially for you i wonder what miss notching we see the booth has got to say about it no i'm not really happy about these balls you know why because they are dry and there is a few cigarette uh rubbish butts. But? We call them butts, the little butts. ends. Butts, yeah. <laughs> My God. Just to confuse your English. How many butts you've got? This butt is that one, that yeah. butt is this one. Uh, this is butt. As, no, cigarette end doesn't look like butt at all. No, can me. we have a look at your butt? Of course not. Of course not. Maybe in another video. Right, and, let's keep going. Yes, yes Chrissy. And, and that butt that you say it's one more butt. You yes. Said butt. Oh my God, how many butts you've got? Poor English people, tell me how you can cope, how you will understand what's going on in your head. Only God knows. Only God knows. It is a confusing language, even for me, and I'm a native English speaker. And if you are new to the channel and you are curious to know about Marika, she is not English, obviously. She's from Armenia. She's got a Georgian mum, and guess what? She speaks fluent Armenian fluent Georgian. She was educated in Russia and she's actually a professor of Russian philosophy. Yeah, so I think you get the understanding she speaks fluent Russian. She speaks fluent Ukrainian. She speaks fluent Greek. She speaks fluent Turkish. And to be honest, her English is not too bad either. Thank you very much. Instead of talking, talking, talking those old languages, I wish I could talk fluent English but my English has just started to recover and I know that one day I will surprise it all. But would it be interesting and funny anymore? I don't think so. I don't think so. We all do like it when she 
digs herself into a hole or makes a bit of a mistake. <laughs> there we go, we got her again. Which one? Well, we'll have an investigation of all those little bits and bobs that a little bit later. Now, I should how investigate <laughs> the hole first. Which, which, whose hole I should invest? There we are. She's totally confused now. Now, feast your eyes and digest upon that. This is what it's all about in Paphos, the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. There's people jet skiing, there's people snorkeling, there's people parasailing. And on top of all that, the sky is blue. The sea is blue. Mr. Paul is dressed head to toe in blue. And for those of you who may have noticed, Miss Ochin Grisila Booth has got an awful lot of blue on as well. So that must mean one thing. All that is missing is you, of course. You. So get yourself on the big bird or a canoe if you want and start paddling like crazy. That's because we all impatiently waiting just for you. And Lord Julian is now broke his screen of the TV because we know he told us that he's watching on his TV on a huge, uh, he's got a huge TV uh, screen. Yes. Yes. yes, and uh, he's knocking and knocking on it. Don't worry, our Lord Julian. We know that he's, he just keeps it as a secret for me to think that I speak that very good English. But I know that he knows that I know that, you know. What have you seen now, Sue? Oh, you want to advertise that place yes. up there? There we are, Pathy in a sea view apartment. One of the greatest apartment complexes in Paphos. Why is that? Because, well, you get to look at that every single moment of your stay out into the blueness of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. For those of you who are used to staying in some of the hotels and perhaps some of the apartment complexes to the rear of downtown in Paphos, all of the restaurants and bars that you so often frequent have always got apartments above them. And next week we are going to go and stay in a little place called Cozy. That's C O S E A living.com. And that's been gifted to us. So we're going to go and spend two evenings in there and have that view straight out into the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. We'll make a couple of videos while we're there. And you never know. Some of you guys might like to go on the internet and book yourself in, understanding that you are literally sitting on the cusp of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean well, I, Sea. I don't really know whether it's going to be nice inside or no, but would we film it, Mr. Paul? We would, correct? We will indeed. We will film it, for, especially for you, because I know, and Mr. Paul also knows that it's very, very useful for you, uh, whether to look for something that you uh, you haven't seen with your own eyes now you will be able to observe it as we will show it to you but the only thing is for sure that when you go out of one of these balconies you will observe that beautiful sea I'm already liking it honestly I don't know how the, the views inside gonna be but of course we we're gonna see and you know what else we say um, because it's like a complimentary for, for us and we say that nobody checks presented horses teeth you never you never translate like, that please you, we never check so if we nobody check we never check we never check presented horses teeth Right, okay. So if someone I mean, gifts you something, gifts you we something. don't check you, it. You don't check it. Well, we're going to check it, and we're going to check it on camera. That's for sure. And on that note, if you are staying in a hotel, and perhaps you'd like us to come and invade your privacy and make a little video in your room, because there's a lot of people who'd like to know what's going on in the room. We understand that some of the hotels have got a bit of a love-hate relationship with ourselves. But one or two of them now, slowly but surely, are opening the doors. And I've just seen a smiling man on the downtown Kedapathos promenade. He's an old, old friend from the harbour, and we're going to go and say a big, big hello to him. You're going to remember him. His name starts with an A, and his name is Yasugumbaru Andreas. Yasugumbaru? Yes, my friend. How are you doing? You all right? Welcome, welcome. Is this your new station? I. Listen, I miss you very much. No comments. We miss you too. 
We miss you too. I am very happy to see you. And I miss to be on the video because people are looking for me. They are looking oh. for you. Say, where is the where is star? Man? Where's the yeah. star of the show? That's, that's right. So, but are you always... hanging out here now, yeah? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Where, where, if I saw you, uh, your video, I'm watching all the time. You go all the time there. You have to come we'll here. We'll come and see you more. We we'll come and see Yasu Gumbaru more and more. So, his new position is outside here. Captain's Bistro and the Captain's View. And i tell you what, they are two of the best restaurants on the promenade. There's no such thing as a bad restaurant in downtown Kedipapos. Not the greatest food in the world, don't get me wrong. They're not gourmet, they're not Michelin stars, but you're always going to get a good meal at a reasonable price with good service. And of course, if you recognize some of these superstars that happen to feature on our little videos, you're always going to get that a little bit extra, that's for sure. Andrea's got a very good sense of humor, therefore I like him. And he's always on positive notes, by the way. Uh, talking about him, uh, he must be very useful man in the entrance of every restaurant, by the way. Yes, he is indeed. We're outside the Moorings restaurant now, another great restaurant that's open all year round. And next door to that, if you want a fancy ice cream, you can get a scoop for two euros or two scoops for 350. So let's go for two, especially if you're from downtown in Nantwich and you're a princess. And of course, your name is Princess Megan. And there's a little gangster of a brother. He's called Gangster Max. Big, big shout out to the Nantwich crew. And we're looking forward to seeing Lady Jessica and of course, Lord Simon in downtown Paphos very, very soon indeed. And hopefully when they come, they'll join us for a few nights in the downtown Cade of Paphos Harbour and the Pelican restaurant, and we can chew the fat and put the world to rights. The temperature must be about 24 degrees, that's for sure. 23, 24, do you think so? I think it could even be higher, to be Maybe honest. Maybe even higher, but uh, what can be much better? What can be much more pleasant? or uh, amazing when you observe such a beauty around you. I know people enjoying this life. What can be better? What can be better? So get yourself on that big bird, on that canoe, paddle like crazy, driftwood, whatever it is, if you're from downtown in damp and dreary Cardiff, with no disrespect to Cardiff, I'm a Welshman. But there are two superstars who reside down there and they're dreaming of coming back to Paphos. Who am I talking about? A couple of barons, a couple of pains, that's for sure. Baron Jeremy and, of course, Baron Simon. We're missing you like crazy and we're waiting for you in downtown Paphos. Of course, we're waiting for all of you. We would like to say thank you very much for being and staying with us for every year's support, loving and kissing you from the bottom of our two hearts. Don't forget to come and see another of our madness. Many kisses and bye-bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to go and hunt us down the Buy Me Coffee platform. Gift us that virtual coffee or two as a thank you to keep us motivated to make these videos, especially for you. We we'll look forward to seeing you again very, very soon indeed, somewhere in and around Paphos, in particular on the Cape of Paphos Promenade and Harbour area.